Alright, what is up everybody? Nardis Bogan here bringing you some more Minecraft. <coughs> and more coughing. And a lot of cobblestone. And a diamond pickaxe. And some scaffolds and some coal. But nonetheless, here's some more Minecraft. And ta da! I finished what I said I was going to. Yay. Uh, yeah, finished the roof. And uh, some of you probably asking if you didn't hear me mention it or if I forgot to mention it, in which case my bad. Uh, why I actually built the glass roof? It's because, <coughs> excuse me. It's because uh, industrial craft, the source of power that I'll probably be using mostly will be solar power from solar panels. So to do that, I need the sun. And uh, really didn't feel like moving all this stuff. So, there we go. And I know some of you are like, well, why didn't you just move this stuff rather than digging out all of this? Well, it's, it's in a good spot, so you know what? There. I did it because I could. And because it gave me a crap ton of materials, which I can now go store in a chest and later on use on something that goes with uh, equivalent exchange and make me a lots of diamonds. Especially with all this cobblestone, it will make me lots of diamonds. And uh, actually, if you haven't noticed, I got a crap ton of stuff in my inventory that I will be explaining in half a second. It's this stuff, if you couldn't tell with the gears and all that. Uh, I'm gonna need some of that cobblestone. And actually, I should keep a set of 64. I don't know why I haven't been doing this. You should always keep a set of 64 on you, no matter what. Just in case. Just in case. Uh, what? Uh, I'm gonna need some redstone. From what I can remember of what I'm going to be building, and I need to put this iron up. Iron. Wrong chest. Iron. There we go. Alright, yeah. If you guys could tell by the materials I had in my inventory, what I was making, great. If you couldn't, I'm about to explain it. And yes, I am changing a block of diamond into a dark matter block. So, actually what I need to do... And yes, I have gotten four. I'll keep two out, just in case. Uh, oh, uh, hmm. Actually, let me see this real quick. Crafting guide, this block of diamond. What all do we... No, actually, I want to take it a bit further. And a bit further, dark matter. What uh, what are we going to be creating? Don't really want to create the tools because it's not really a need to. Uh, red matter. That's way later. Armor. The armor would be nice because the armor is indestructible, doesn't take damage whatsoever. So that would be nice, but that takes 24 dark matter. It takes 24 of anything to create an entire set of armor. So, uh, no. Where's... I would like to get this Swift Wolf's Rendering Gale, because that is amazing. The Watch of Flowing Time's pretty good. Two to get that? If I did three, then I'd have one left over. I don't know why I'm thinking about this, because usually by the time I get this, I'm already pretty well off. But, you know... You know, you know, you know. I also want to get this destruction catalyst, and I know I can probably make it right now. Actually, I'm pretty sure I can, but it's not the point. What the point is, is... Alright, let's get off that. I am going to be making... If Buildcraft is where I believe it is... Copper. This is... That was not Buildcraft. This, what, um, uh, mm hmm, where's Buildcraft? It was in the 900s prior to me getting Industrial Craft. So with Industrial Craft, it should have pushed it down 200, maybe? So you'd think it'd be around here? But it's not. No, it's not. Um, but we'll just keep going up till we find Buildcraft. Oh, there it is, because the pops. Yes, alright. What we are making in Buildcraft is a quarry. Quarry. Quarry? I think that's right. Anyway, so, yeah. To do that, we will need three iron gears, two gold, and two diamond, and one diamond pickaxe, and one of those. We have two iron gears, two diamond, two gold, 
big axe, and uh, I figured I'd take you through the gear processification. I realize that's not what it's called. Anyways, so to make a basic gear, you just take sticks. Just take sticks, and you only need four, and you lay them out like that. That makes a uh, that makes one gear. And just so I don't have empty sticks, empty sticks. Just so I don't have random sticks laying around, I will make them into torches. Uh, then you get your stone gear from stone. Add one, two, three, four. And same exact thing. You get your iron. And if you want gold, you do the same thing from iron. You want diamond, you do the same thing from that. So, nonetheless, that's how you get it. Just figured I'd show you guys that really quickly. And you throw all this highly expensive stuff in, and you get yourself a quarry. And the steam engines I'm going to be using to power the quarry. But, uh, I figured I only need two because I figured I wouldn't be checking it often. Oh, need to get that. That's still going. That's obviously still going. Boom. Half of it in there. Uh, 64, 16 in there, and 16 in storage. Because I like to do all my stuff precisely. Just because that way it's cleaner. Just because that way. I don't know. Uh, yeah, my bed's down here if you haven't noticed. If you have, great. It'd kind of be hard to miss it. I should really go chop down those trees out there. But, nonetheless, my bed is down here because on the floor that it was currently on, zombies were up above, and it was like, oh, you can't sleep. There's stuff above you. So I was like, um... Well, well, I guess I'll just move it down. I didn't want to because now that room's like pointless, completely, 100% pointless. But, oh uh, well, I guess it's just gonna be pointless. Oh, and uh, someone told me I should get the portal mod in this, you know, with the uh, obviously the portal guns, you know, shoot it, teleport, all that. Or not really teleport. You go through the portal. You you get what I'm saying though. You know. You get the basic idea of the portal gun. You can just apply that to Minecraft and see basically what you'd get. And uh, I tried to, and uh, once again it was like, I know, I know, sir. I do not think so. So I was just like, whatever. It doesn't. I mean, I don't know. I am kind of mad because you know that would have been great. So I could just teleport from this house to the other instead of. Running, oh snap, I'm stepping all over this. Instead of having to run all the way over there, which is what I'm going to do in this video, because I don't feel like editing it all that much, and that's that's what I'm going to have to do if I if I want to cut that part out, is edit it, and I don't feel like doing that. Like, if it was easier for me to line up my voice and all that, yeah, probably would. And it's really not too ridiculously hard, but eh, why? Well, I mean, I mean, I can, I can fill that void of a half a minute, not a half a minute, of a minute and a half, is what I meant to say, of me walking over there. I mean, if I can fill that void for an hour while I play Skyrim, which is a different void because you know there's more stuff going on, then I'm pretty sure I can fill this void. Which again, there's different stuff going on in Skyrim, so it's a little bit easier, but nonetheless, I can fill it. I can tell you guys about my day. Oh. That's why I love fences now. They're not whole blocks, so you can put them on the outside of your crops. You just walk all past them. It's great. But, I should probably go store this stuff before I go over to the second house, but I'm too lazy to go back inside the